Hello viewers, welcome to the 20th edition of Raxio Awa in 2021 and the second in the month of June. This week, we bring you commentaries from a few guests at the recently concluded Raxio UG launch. We asked each one of them a couple of questions in relation to Raxio data center and what their expectations were moving forward for their respective companies and the Ugandan economy at that. Let us now listen to what they had to say. My name is Mwanje Mark. I'm the managing director of Experian Uganda. Experian is a credit reference bureau company uh, that has been operating as CompuScan in Uganda and I'm happy to be here at today's launch. My name is Albert Morongi. I am uh, the head of ICT at the Uganda Electricity Generation Company Limited. Hi, my name is Emily Banya and I'm the marketing person at the American Chamber of Commerce in Uganda, which is Amsterdam, Uganda. My name is uh, Caroline Ruth Ateng Olimurungi Wamara from Agent Banking Company of Uganda Limited. My name is Barbara Victoria Namoviru, Account Relationship Manager with Brock Telecom for the Enterprise Clans. We are reseller partners with Raxio. Data Center. Uh, congratulations to the directors and the founding uh, directors for the Data Center. Uh, our expectations are very, you know, simple that uh, we will be able to, you know, find easier ways of collocating our data infrastructure, our databases, uh, creating an opportunity for us to, you know, bring down the cost of doing business and uh, create more efficiencies. I think this is the first among the first tier three data centers in the region. At an organization level, really, we hope to benefit from the service that the data center will be offering, which is uh, co-location. And uh, you know, they have taken on the apartment model, where you can take on a full, a full apartment, or half an apartment, or quarter an apartment. So I really think um, this is really going to be a very, very big uh, contribution, especially to the IT sector. Uh, and it will save us a lot of money not to invest in uh, ICT infrastructure, especially data centers, since all the services like power and cooling will be offered centrally. Personally, as an East African and as a Ugandan, my expectations going forward after the launch, because I was so amazed by the top-notch quality of the facilities that they gave us a tour of, and also their personnel. They have attention to detail, they're very attentive, and they are very, very professional. So my expectations going forward with the Raxio data is just seeing um, data coming back home. We thank Raxio that has come with a very beautiful data center to help us house all our data. When you look at our background as a banking sector, we need somewhere to store this data for so many years. My great expectation right now is to see that our corporate organizations realize the need to have safer, uh, better, more tech-savvy uh, data units um, and storages. They can't have it in where their offices are. It's not sufficient enough. So my expectation is that corporate organizations realize this and bring their storage units to a more safe, more tech-savvy um, data space. So we say thank you, Raxio, because our expectations are 100% met from my perspective. The launch was great. It represented us, who we are, what we are, and what we aim for the future when it comes to technology and data services. In general, anything I say about this Raxio is, it is the place to be. Raxio is the place to be. It is the one-stop data center that anyone that has data in Uganda would look out for. Thank you. See you next time, viewers, and have a lovely weekend.